Hey guys, and welcome back to Tech Genie. Firstly, I'd like to apologize for all the lighting. We're doing it in this room because I need to use the computer. Secondly, don't forget if you did enjoy this video to smash the thumbs up. It'd be great if we could reach 20 likes on this video. That would be awesome. I hope this video helps you guys out. Also, if you're not already, make sure you're following us on Twitter. That's at Tech Genie T3G. I will leave the links down below. And also go and check out our Facebook page as well and leave a like on that if you want. So without any further ado, let's get straight into this tutorial. Okay, so what we're doing in this video is we are jailbreaking an iPhone. Now this is the iPhone 4, it's a pretty old phone and it is currently running iOS 7.1.1. So this will be a jailbreak for iOS 7.1.1, but I will leave a link down below for the newest jailbreak that is currently available. Now this is gonna be done on a Mac computer. Now, if you were wondering and you're on iOS 10 and you're wondering if there's gonna be a jailbreak on iOS 10.1.1, which is the newest release of iOS 10, then possibly coming out in the future, there should be a jailbreak for you guys as well. Now recently, I think about three days ago, iOS 10.1.1 was released. Now we're expecting a possible release of a new Pangu jailbreak, which should be coming out hopefully not too long from now. We'll give it a few weeks and maybe it'll be released. Now the reason I say this is because iOS 10.2 is coming out in December and most likely Pangu will want to release its jailbreak before that comes out to get it out there and actually working because iOS 10.2 will most likely patch any problems with security in iOS 10.1.1. So we're hoping a new jailbreak for you guys will be coming out soon. And if there is, I may report on it and let you guys know if you want. If you do want to know and you want to see any more future videos on things you can do with the jailbreak on iPhone, don't forget to smash that like button and let me know down below. Okay, so the first thing we want to do is head to the link down below and that will take you to Pangu. Now this is Pangu 1.1.0, which will allow you to jailbreak iOS 7.1.1. I'll just show to you guys, this is an iPhone 4 here. I'll take you into settings. So if you can see there, it says version 7.1.1. I'm sorry if the lighting is now even more weird from what it was before. Now the first thing you want to do is head to the link to download Pangu 1.1.0. To make sure that works, make sure you head into your um, system preferences, go up to security and privacy, and make sure anywhere is allowed. Um, now what you want to do is, once you've installed it, you'll see it's here on your desktop. If you double click that, you will get this little window here. Double click this, and it should now open the app. Okay, so if I move this to the front, it now gives us some sort of instructions at the top, and I'm gonna talk you through this. So it leaves you some instructions at the top, and basically you just want to follow those. It says connect your device, device and click jailbreak button to begin. So we're just gonna get our device here, I'm going to plug it into the computer using the USB lead, now for some reason it's telling me this is an iPhone 3, that's wrong, it's an iPhone 4. Uh, what you want to do now is go ahead and click jailbreak. It now tells you to adjust the date and it tells you how to do that. So we're going to go into settings, we're going to go under general and we're going to go under date and time. We're now going to turn off set automatically. Okay, so it's asked me to set my date back to the 2nd of June 2014. You can now see it is injecting the bundles and basically what it's going to be doing is installing the app Pangu onto the phone on my device. Now this does take a while, so don't get worried if it's sort of not doing a lot for a while, it will be doing it. But make sure you've put your date back to the 2nd of June 2014 at 6 o'clock p.m. So it now says, please tap the Pangu icon on your device to continue. So if I head home, you can now see that I have the app there on the desktop. That is the Pangu app there. It now wants me, it says, please tap the Pangu, Pangu app to continue. So I'm just going to do that. And then it asks me, are you sure you want to open it? I'm just going to press continue. And then it opens the app here. And then processing on the computer, you can see we've now got this. It says, please keep the device connected and do not close the app. So don't touch anything on the phone screen. Just let this continue and let it play out. Now, my device is now on the table. I'm not going to move it because this cable is a little bit sketchy. But basically, we've just got the black screen with that little turning circle. It will now reboot and I will show you what it looks like in a minute. So you can see it's now rebooting. Now this will probably take a while to actually completely reboot. Okay, so the device has now rebooted. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to slide the device to unlock. It's just this normal lock screen. Okay, so it's now done. It's now rebooting the device again. Now while this is rebooting for the second time, I will just explain a few things to you. If you do get stuck in a boot loop, in other words, it does still say, have the Pangu screen and still say it's rebooting, just press the power button and the home button while you're rebooting and it should fix it you should be good to go hopefully fingers crossed 
So it's now rebooting, I've got the Apple logo again. So this is the screen. If you get stuck on this screen, hold down the home button and the power button at the same time. Okay, so it's now rebooting again. So presumably it reboots three times. So I'm just going to leave it and you can see it is now booted up. That is the home screen, everything is working fine. And you can see now, if I slide there, we now have Cydia installed on the desktop now. I'm pretty excited about this because this is the first time I've ever jailbroken a phone and there's so much cool stuff you can do with this. So I'm just gonna dive in here and show you what you need to do from here. I'm just gonna change the camera angle a bit. Okay, so from here we are good to go. We need to just remove the phone from the computer, just unplug it now, and we can then move on to the phone and continue with where we left off. Okay, so if I now slide to unlock, and just turn it on, slide to unlock, you can see I now have Cydia. Now what we want to do is make sure we are connected to the internet before we actually open Cydia because it needs to download some files. So I'm just going to do that now, head into settings and connect to the Wi-Fi. Okay, so you can see we are now connected to the internet. You can see I've got the Wi-Fi bar up at the top. Um, I don't know if you can actually see the screen. I'll turn the brightness down a little bit. So now we're going to head home and we're going to head into the Cydia app, open that up and it's going to prepare the file system. So you can see there it says it will exit once it's complete. And once it's done this, we'll be ready to go and dive into Cydia and start downloading sources and messing about with the phone. Okay, so it is now completed. You can see it's now rebooting the device and it has now rebooted. So I'm just gonna to slide to unlock. I'm gonna open Cydia and it should now take us within Cydia ready to use. So here we go, we are now within Cydia and you can see everything is there like it should be. I'm not gonna do anything now. So I'm going to tell you, I'm show you, I'm still running iOS 7.1. You can see there iOS 7.1.1. So we have just jailbroken the iPhone. Okay, so guys, if you did enjoy that video, I hope it helped you guys out. If you do have an iPhone that you want to jailbreak, it's just a quick tutorial. It's the same with the newer versions or it's ever so slightly updated. It is very, very similar. Just follow the same steps that I did with your newer iPhone on the newer versions of Pangu. It will work. I will leave a link down below for the newest downloads for Pangu for the uh, newest versions or the newest jailbreak that there is. If you guys want to see some tutorials of stuff to do with the jailbroken iPhone, leave a link, uh, comment down below and also smash the thumbs up. I look forward to seeing you in the next video guys. Don't forget to subscribe and live long and prosper.